from B Late team also Bethany was um, diagnosed with cerebral palsy. Bethany couldn't eat, swallow, drink. Um, she was only given a two years lifespan to begin with. So each day to us as a family is a blessing and we don't we don't live for the week, we don't live for a year, we live day by day with Bethany. Are you Bethany? This is Bethany, yeah. <laughs> I'm Chappy, welcome to Manchester City. Manchester City made a wish come true for one lucky girl when Bethany Rigg visited City's Football Academy with her sisters Morgan and Lexi as part of the club's wish-granting charity, the Starlight Children's Foundation. Her mum, Leanne, tells us more. It was a surgeon that, that approached me about Starlight Charity. Um, so we filled the farms in and the surgeon wrote a, a letter and then um, Bethany was asked like, what, if she could have a dream, what would it be? And her first wish on the board was Manchester City. Our girl's still here, so she really, really deserves her, her final wish, and this is it, City. After getting up close and personal with her city heroes and watching the first team train, the surprises didn't stop there as next up was a meet and greet with Steph Horton and the women's team. Here you go my friend. You okay? I've got these boots. You good? They're a private show. You're going to play? Can you play? You're a striker? Come on then. Yes. Here's Nikita. Nikita scores all the goals. You know. She's going to be the famous one. Yes. Oh yeah, it was lovely. It's nice to meet the little kids and you know see a lot of smile on the faces. So you know, any time we get a chance to do it, I think I get more from that than actually playing football. To be honest, but it's a special feeling. There we go. I love the integration that we have here at City. You know, I think we really get out into the community. We make fans feel welcome, feel special. We give them opportunities that they wouldn't get at other clubs and. You know, as a player, I love being a part of it and, you know, could take five minutes out of my day, could take four hours, but as long as the kids are happy and smiling and the fans are happy, then, you know, they, they're the ones coming and supporting us week in, week out, and, you know, it's just, it's just a good position to be in. <laughs> Scored! Yes! <laughs> well played. Great goalkeeping. I reckon Bethany inside is feeling the butterflies and the excitement and wow, that's how, how we're feeling, is this happening? And to finish her wish, Bethany made sure she didn't go home without one thing, an autograph and picture from her favourite player, Sergio Aguero. Perfect. We were kids and uh, our desire is to always uh, know the, the famous people, the famous players. So we are in the other side now and we have the opportunity to, uh, to bring a, a big smile in this, uh, in this face. So it's, it's happy for us as well. Hey, bye bye, good girl. Thanks, God. Bethany hasn't stopped going on about City since being the age of eight. Um, and for this to become reality for Bethany, she's really excited, emotions, happy, and she would take this away for the rest of her life. I couldn't thank the players enough for, for making her feel welcome and making her feel a part of, of the city's environment. Um, she was overwhelmed, as I said. Oh my gosh. Wow, that's amazing. Fit in my own shirt. Got, it's a heart and a barrow.